All right, hey, Hayes Omega here, and welcome to another Hayes Omega channel video. And, uh, and we're here in my office, or where the YouTube magic happens, my room. And uh, and those of you that watch some of the videos on my channel know that I'm an anime figure collector. Right? I've been doing it for a while now. Okay, <laughs> like more, almost like two decades. Oh my god. Um, and today I bought one of these things. All right, so this is a. Uh, an air purifier all right so uh, one of these things and you, you may notice my window fan is running uh, I don't have air conditioning in my room um, and air guess what air conditioners do they they uh, condition the air right they clean it so um, but Hayes Mega lives in a place where I we don't we really need air conditioning right it gets hot but it doesn't get that hot <laughs> okay and um, and then yeah so I've got this problem in my room all right and you see I got all these figures in here and uh, with dust all right I get a lot of dust in my room I don't know why uh, it's probably because I live here and I'm running a window fan all right so I have a window fan is sucking out sucking in air from outside and there it must be sucking in some dust and stuff so all right and also um, and yeah so I bought this so I can try to reduce the amount of dust in my room hopefully it'll work all right uh, um, it's an air purifier. What it does is it cleans the air in your room, all right? So it, it's kind of like an air conditioner, but it doesn't cool the room, all right? Um, it, it just makes it, it, it makes the air nicer to breathe in here, okay? And so I'm thinking this this guy will, um, well, this will be a little experiment is what I want to say, <laughs> all right? Um, maybe in a, in a few months or so, I'll have a follow-up video, all right? But my my idea is that if I run this guy all the time, it'll help keep the dust levels down in my room right there's a couple there's a um, there's a couple things in my room that are dust sensitive like me okay I don't like dust um, and my anime figures all right you can see back in the back there I've got plenty of anime figures and I've got them in display cases why is to keep the dust off of them right somehow the dust still gets into the cases even though I seal them and stuff but uh, as much as possible, I try to keep the dust out of there as much as possible, and everything else in my room still gets dusty. Right? I, you can see. Um, yeah, let's, let's, let's go. Let's go look around the room a little bit. Okay. Yeah, I'm constantly dusting stuff. All right. So this is my pile of figures that I've still, still got to take out of the boxes and review and stuff. So here they are. These are my glasses, my reading glasses. Man, I hate these mega's getting old. You can see there's dust starting to form on these boxes. All right. Yeah. See. And I do, I do realize that yes, some dust is your uh, your dry skin flaking, okay? And I, I'm not gonna lie, that happens to me, but it only happens to me in the winter time, all right? So, yeah. So you can see on this Google Chromecast that I've never opened yet, <laughs> it's it's dirty, all right? Pretty dirty, okay? And it, it seems to be this area right here is the dirtiest, all right? Because everything here is really dusty. Okay, I gotta I gotta wipe it down. It's so dirty. Okay, and I think it's because we're running this thing. All right. Unfortunately, I cannot find a window fan that uh, has an air filter in it. All right. I used to have one, and they don't make them anymore, unfortunately. So, so that's why I've decided to try and run this thing. Okay. Um, even my figures that are in the display cases. All right. The, the figures themselves, no dust. All right. But on top of them plenty of dust look at this okay so Hayes Omega is gonna go on a dust fest probably soon <laughs> so let's say another thing another uh... yeah I was watching rental Kanojo by the way yeah <laughs> um, and uh, another thing that is dust sensitive is my computer all right and this is the kind of like this is what I use on a daily basis all right as you can see you can look at my gun safe my gun safe I put my feet on top of it and you can tell where I put my feet right because the rest of it is all dusty all right but you can see dust right here all right I know we should do some dusting but in a vacuum the vents and the fans and all that stuff but yeah look at all this it's nasty all right so yeah I should probably wipe a lot of this stuff down but I'm hoping that running this guy will will uh, reduce the amount of dust in here okay so another uh, another thing I, I another reason I want to get this is because we've 
We've had uh, uh, some wildfires, all right? Uh, recently, we'd have wildfire smoke from the fires up north. And, um, and yeah, and sometimes that stuff gets sucked into my room and I have to breathe it. And Hazemega realized a couple years ago when we had some really bad wildfire smoke uh, that Hazemega is sensitive to, to wildfire smoke, okay? I, I, I feel awful when, when it happens, all right? And, uh, and yeah, sometimes it gets so hot in here, I need to suck in cooler air, right? So, and I use that thing, man. So, I know he's making sure to get air conditioner. <laughs> but, uh, but yeah, this is the next best thing right here. Okay, and um, so let's go. We'll go open it up in a bit, but I got this on Amazon. All right, so this is going to be a little experiment, guys. Uh, but I got this on Amazon. It's a Levoit. Uh, 100s all right, and uh, it's listed for as uh, 140 or 139.99 uh, But I got a coupon all right, and I had to use the app to get the coupon I realized I tried to buy it on my computer. I was like that's weird. There was a coupon for it There was a $25 coupon all right, so I got saved $25 and I got free shipping on it So the total damage after taxes was $128. Okay, so not too bad uh, I bought this one because it's small and compact. As you can see, my room doesn't have a whole lot of space in it, man. I got like figures everywhere. There's, and yeah, and I have this bookcase here, and, and my bed is right there. So, so uh, let's go. Uh, let's go unbox this, and then we'll go take a look at some of the feet. Let's go. Actually, let's go take a look at the box okay. real quick. Uh, um, by the way, it took like two days for it to get to me. All right, it was super fast shipping. Uh, thanks, thanks Amazon, because uh, yeah, I'm trying to get the dust down in my room ASAP. All right, so I'm hoping. This guy will do that, all right? So it's a Levoit Vital 100S Smart True HEPA air purifier, okay? Um, it's, uh, I guess it can, I guess it kind of acts as like a fan too, but it, um, yeah, it's supposed to clean the air in your room and it has a air filter element in it, all right? That will suck in the air and take the dust out of it, all right? And you, and it's, it's, re, it's reusable too, according to advertising, all right? So there it is. Check out our helpful quick start guide. Okay. Household use only. I don't know what that means. <laughs> uh, so it has a three stage true HEPA filtration. Okay. Uh, it has a washable pre filter. All right. That's what I was talking about. You can take the filter out, and, and that, that's the one that catches most of the contaminants. All right. That's the one that's going to be sucking out all the dust out of there. That's good. All right. It captures dust, lint, fibers, hair, and pet fur. And it helps protect the lifespan of the H13 True HEPA filter. All right, Hayes Mega. Not gonna lie, Hayes Mega sheds a lot of hair, especially when he has long hair. Okay, so um, H13 True HEPA filter. I don't have pets, by the way, so that's that's one good thing. <laughs> I used to have chinchillas, man, and they had they get fur and dust everywhere. I wish I had this when I had chinchillas. That's for sure. All right, it traps at least 99.97 percent of 0.3 micron airborne particles including fine dust smoke particles pollen and pet dander so um, haze mega usually gets allergies one one every every season i get allergies all right there's like some kind of pollen in the air well this will help filter that out all right and it will reduce the amount of uh, um, allergies that i'll have so that's good that and the smoke, all right, all that stuff. You, you don't want to be um, inhaling any of that pet dander. I don't really have to worry about that because I don't have any pets. Um, and then third is a high efficiency activated carbon filter. It filters vol volatile organic compounds and helps neutralize smoke, fumes, and household odors from food, cigarettes, and pets. Okay, so yeah, it takes, if you got any weird smells in your room, it'll It'll help suck that up, all right? And from what I heard, uh, the HEPA filter needs to be replaced um, every like six months or something, okay? Um, so here's what comes in the package is the air purifier, a washable pre-filter already installed, a true HEPA activated carbon filter, all right, a manual, a quick start guide, and an AC power adapter, okay? You just plug it into the wall. Uh, also, also, oh yes, this is the smart version, all right? Um, it says you can download you can download an app, all right. And I think you gotta scan this QR code right here. You can download an app on your phone. You can connect it to your Wi-Fi, and then you can monitor it. Okay, guys. Um, and let's check this side of the box out. Okay, and then there's some other features there. It has a uh, three large air inlets. Okay, uh, that's good. 
it means it's gonna it's gonna suck in a lot of air and clean it up right and sleep mode there's a sleep mode um, I think you can turn it on when you're going to sleep it will it'll lower the speed of the fans and then in the daytime when the Sun comes up it'll speed it up all right um, so like it's it's whisper quiet at night all right so that's another thing yeah haze Meg, I'm not gonna lie haze Meg is a heavy sleeper so I, I don't think it that bothers me man I could sleep with that that window fan on all night long all right and it wouldn't bother me okay so well, yeah okay uh, and it uh, has a washable pre-filter all right so whenever that gets dirty you just take it out and wash it just like uh, like an air filter on your car or something you know kind of like that and there's a pet mode all right app only um, I don't have pets, so so don't have to worry about that. Hip, okay, so let's go open it up, and then uh, I'll we'll fire it up, and then uh, and then uh, it, I guess when I get the app running, I'll show you what what kind of uh, features the app has, and then that'll be the end of the video. And then I'll have a uh, follow up video in the next few months, and I'll let you know if it works. All right. Um, but yeah, sometimes Hayes Mega has trouble breathing and stuff when you know the air quality is bad. I'm, I hate to say it, man. I live in the city and the air is polluted here in the city, man. And some, I mean, some days are better than others. Not gonna lie. And um, and yeah, I'm hoping that you know this will help me breathe a little better. All right, I've never had one of these, and we're gonna try it out for the first time. Okay, uh, so let's go open it up and we'll take a look at it. But yeah, one the reason I wanted to buy this is. Uh, Yes, for my anime figures to keep dust off of it, keep dust off of my computer and for my lungs, okay? <laughs> and this is a, it wasn't super duper expensive. I mean, I guess you could buy air conditioner for about. Also, it doesn't consume a lot of electricity too, so. Okay, there's the unit inside. It kind of looks like a, uh, what is it, a paper shredder? Just turn it upside down. Ah, there's a, this looks like the power cord right here. All right, it was at the bottom of the unit. It's pretty cool. It's white. It looks pretty long, a few feet long. Okay. So take the plastic cover off. Just like it is a show and tell video, guys. Just like my figure videos. Just uh, it's not on the figure. <laughs> all right, but it is for my figures. Okay, guys, that's one of the main reasons I bought. All right, there's a manual right here. Okay, uh, let me take a look at the quick start guide, and then uh, we'll go fire it up. Okay, we're gonna go through the setup process. All right, but that's what came out. The, uh, the there's a quick start guide here, a, a user's manual here, um, the power adapter. And then the unit itself. It's pretty small, guys. Let me see. It's about, like I said, it's about the size of a paper shredder. It's very light, too. Okay, I think this is where the power adapter plugs in. Okay, pretty cool. And then there are buttons on top, too. Okay, so the power adapter is underneath the air purifier. Okay. I already figured it out when I took it out of the box. So. Oh, there's a protective plastic on it. You know what? I'm going to leave that plastic on. Yeah, I'm going to leave that protective plastic on until it just falls off. All right, guys. Because <laughs> Hayes Meg is, is like that. That's what I'll say. Okay. Yeah, well, there's, there's the buttons and stuff. All right. So they're like kind of touch buttons. All right. They're not tactile. There's a power button here, uh, speed, um, this looks like an automatic fan here. There's a sleep mode, um, I think this is a timer, and then this turns it off. Or then maybe this turns off turns it off when there's uh, sunlight or something. I don't know, I'll we'll figure it out. Okay, so the first thing it says is pull both sides of the front cover to remove it. So I guess... Yeah, okay, that's the front cover. Very simple. Okay, the second thing is push the pre-filter tabs downward to remove the pre-filter from the air purifier. This thing. Okay. And then, uh, okay, and then remove the filter and plastic packaging. Okay, so you can't run this thing right off. Oh yeah, before using, remove the plastic from the, okay, there you go. I think. You gotta pull it off. 
pull this and the whole thing should come out alright. Okay, not. And you can buy you can buy uh filters from Amazon. So. I'll put a link in the description where you can get one of these guys. Alright. I got this one because it's smaller. They have bigger ones and they have ones that are shaped like a um like a uh cylinder or something okay okay let's take this yeah make sure everything is nice and sealed properly you know because you know it's got to be clean say um kind of sterile product <laughs> okay okay and then there's a it tells you how to put it in there's an arrow here okay, i think i think we just put it back in let me see so i've taken it out place the filter and free filter back into the air purifier okay so you know this is the front, it says it right here, and then there's a, it says it, you know, what direction it goes in. So shove that in there, it's got a little gasket around it too. Pretty cool. Okay, put that back in there. I guess you're supposed to have this little tab in there. Alright, put the pre-filter back in. Okay, snap it in there. Then uh, place the front cover back on. And then, yeah, that's pretty much it. All right, so there's these little claws that go on the bottom here. Just slide it in there. Okay, and just press forward on it. There you go. Now it's ready to operate. So let me go fire it up, and then, uh, and then I'll go. I'll go play around with the app. <laughs> okay. So before uh, we fire it up, actually, let me turn my window fan off so you guys can hear how loud this bad boy is. Okay. Um, so there also it mentions here to clean the dust sensor. There's a sensor here you gotta clean, and I'll be able to leave the sticker here so I don't forget. <laughs> so I think you open this and it gives you access to the dust sensor, and you're supposed to um, clean this with a swab, this here and in here, and right here. Okay, so I guess after a while um, these will get clogged up with dust. All right, so you're gonna wanna use a moistened cotton swab to clean the outlet and to clean the air in. Okay, there's an intake and out, uh, intake and exhaust, right? So I think what it does is it it senses the, it measures the uh, the speed, the, uh, the inlet and the outlet, and when when the exhaust gets uh, slower than the inlet, it tells you to, hey, you need to clean this thing, okay? So, <laughs> all right. So, so yeah, it does require some maintenance, guys. You can't just let it, leave it running forever, you know? If you want it running at its top efficiency, you've got to maintain it, okay, guys? All right, so let, uh, let me go fire this thing up and play around with it, and then I'll I'll show you guys uh, how it works. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and plug it into the uh, the outlet. All right, so I've got a power outlet back okay. here, and there's a there's a thingamajigger back power here. Power thing right here. That's where it plugs in. Okay. Okay, so uh, on the back of the quick on the quick start guide, it tells you how you can download the uh, the apps. All right, there's there's an app for Apple phones, and there's one for uh, for Android. All right, so I'm gonna go get my photo app and get a picture of that. All right, and then hit there. All right, and then it should go to the download. I'm gonna go download it right now. It's sending me these advertisements. It's downloading, downloading, downloading. Yeah, to use the app and like its functions and stuff, you need to have a Wi-Fi. Okay, guys, so. Whose homes don't have Wi-Fi now? And you could also, also you could use it without Wi-Fi. Uh, you could use it on your phone when you're away from home. All right, so you you could literally check the status of your air purifier whenever you want. All right, like wherever you are. That's what I'm saying. Okay, we're gonna hit open. Hopefully this thing. I'm gonna sign up. Okay, I'm gonna put my login info. Okay, sign up. Oh, you, it needs a strong password, guys. Not strong enough. Okay, it's going to send me some kind of confirmation thing. Okay, it says registration successful. Do I want to save my password? Sure, why not? All right, and then I'm going to allow. All right, and there it is. I don't know why they gave me Hades Omega yada da 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 as my thing, but it's fine. All right, and there it is. Um, and then we're going to hit add device. And oh, there's like they have like smart outlets. No, it's air quality, I think. All right, and then we're gonna we gotta look for our device. All right. Uh, oh, well, wow, they sell a lot of uh, smart enabled products. 
All right, I'm gonna go look for it. Okay, here it is. <laughs> so under purifier, it says the Voight Vital 100S. That's the one. Okay, and then uh, allow access to nearby devices. Uh, go to settings. Hit allow. Okay. And then click to enable the access. I already did. Oh, there we go. Okay, and then it's going to ask you, do you want to give access to this app? So yeah, you got to do a lot of stuff to set the app up first. Okay, so this is searching for devices. I think it's found it already. Just click that. And then press and hold the power button for five, connecting to your, okay. Press and hold the power button for five seconds until the Wi-Fi indicator starts blinking. Okay, so I'm going to do that. Okay, now the Wi-Fi thing is blinking. Okay, you can see it blinking right there. You have to hold that for five seconds. Okay, there we go. And then now it's uh, asking all my Wi-Fi info. Okay, it's going to connect it to the Wi-Fi once you put your Wi-Fi info in. Successfully connected to router. It says it's syncing to the cloud. Yeah, it's it's kind of it's kind of difficult. Uh, I want to say so. Assigned to an existing room. Hmm. Okay. Just say, I don't know. Can you just let's name your room? It's a otaku layer. That's what I'll put. <laughs> otaku layer. There you go. All right. Uh, assigned to existing. Okay. Next. All right. Device name. Give your device a name you'll remember. How about just Vital 100S? Keep it simple. It's fine. I don't need a custom icon. It says new firmware update is available. Okay, let's update it. Wow, this is so cool, guys. It's a smart device. <laughs> I don't have too many of these smart devices, but hallelujah for uh, software engineers. <laughs> okay, so this is successfully updated. Hit done. Done. Okay, uh, third-party apps. Uh, let's not uh, let's not do that right now. Okay, so there it is. So indoor quality is very good. That's good. All right, and you can turn it on. Just heard it right now so that's setting one that's two three and four okay at four it's pretty loud guys <laughs> not gonna lie all right so what there's one again one is pretty quiet man there's a freaking diesel truck running out there sorry guys but I can barely hear it at setting one. Okay, setting two again. Okay, setting two is significantly, like, like twice as loud as setting one. Okay, and there's three. And there's four again. Okay. Cool. Explore the settings by opening the pop-up menu. Okay. There it is. Okay. Okay, light detection. Uh, the display will automatically turn off in low light and the air purifier will operate more quietly. So I guess when you turn the lights off, it'll be it'll be quieter because it's, th it's thinking you're gonna go to sleep or something, okay? Um, so, okay, I won't play around with that. Uh, display lock. You can only control the air purifier through, uh, through V-Sync when the display lock is on, okay? Pretty cool. There's a timer here. Okay, you can set it to up to eight hours. It's saying, um, and then you can schedule it too. So it open it like you can match it to your schedule or something. All right, I'm just gonna have it run like pretty much all the time. All right. <laughs> okay, and so yeah, that's the app right there. Um, and then you have to just go to the devices all the time. So you can have you, you can have like one of these in each room, and then you can ha you can. 
you can turn them on and everything see so it says it's in a, a, my otaku layer right so <laughs> you okay there's a sleep mode a pet mode and an auto mode okay what's well, auto oh yeah so it also tells you outdoor pm 2.5 is two the pollen is low medium wow it's smart dude yeah so that's what the nice thing about the app it tells you all this stuff right um I think, actually, I think this outdoor stuff is probably, it probably gets it from a forecast. That's what I'm thinking. All right. But this is the indoor quality. This is, is very good in here. So, okay. That's good. All right. So I'm just going to have this running the same time I'm running my window fan. All right. And, and yeah. So let's go take a look at the, uh, the buttons on there and then that'll be the end of the video. Okay, I can feel the air. It's coming out from over here. So it has, a in it says it has three inlets. So obviously it's going to suck the air in through here. And it blows it out here, okay? So you get your purified air through here. All right, and then, so this is your fan speed. Okay, that's the highest setting. That's the lowest setting. That's the two, three. It takes like a second for it to spool up too. Okay, that's the highest setting right there. All right, and then you can set a timer. It starts at eight hours, two hours, four hours, and eight, okay? And then uh, this is some kind of light sensor mode. Oh, this turns the light off. Lights off. Okay. If, you're, if, it, if the lights bother you, okay. And you can lock the display. And this is something about reset filters. So I think uh, at, when the filters are dirty, it's going to remind you. Okay. But, um, and then you can clean the the air filter, the 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 main filter. You can clean it, and then the HEPA filter. You can replace it. All right. I think it's going to tell you when to replace it. Is my guess. All right. Okay, and uh, yeah, you know, I think I'm just going to leave it right here in front of my garbages. All right. Don't worry, my garbages are pretty clean. Okay, so I'm going to leave it right here because I feel this is the most dirtiest part of the room because my window fan just sucks in all this air and stuff, all right? So um, that's why everything is so dirty around here. It's really, really dirty uh, compared to everywhere else in the room. So I'm going to keep this over here. Hopefully, it will keep everything clean in here, all right? And then Hay Hayes Mega will have a dusting party sometime in the near future all right and now i'm going to dust everything and then uh i will i will report back to tell you how clean my room is in the cup in like in a month or something okay we'll look we'll look how clean my room is all right but you can see it's pretty dusty man look at that yeah dusty yeah dusty <laughs> okay but that there it is um so that's at the highest setting and yeah you can you can do a bunch of stuff with it all right um but that's that's as far as i'm going to get into it all right so that's why that's why i bought it again uh so i can keep these guys uh nice and dust free all right and uh everything else so it, it reduces the amount of dusting i have to do in the room also to keep my computer from getting all dusty too so Hopefully, hopefully that'll do the trick, and also to uh, reduce the amount of allergens. Okay, and uh, when when the air quality is bad outside, you know, uh, um, it'll make the air quality better inside the house. Okay, so particularly in my room. All right, so I'm just gonna leave this guy on all the time. So, <laughs> or uh, or I think you can put it in auto mode, and it'll adjust the fan according to like how bad the air quality is or something. So I'll figure something out. Um, it's pretty small. You can put it, like I said, it's about the size. It's literally almost, it's smaller than my garbage can, as you can see. Um, I was thinking of putting it on the windowsill here. It might it might actually fit here, so. But I think just show, right down here is fine. It'll be hard to get to my garbage. Maybe I'll put it behind my garbage can. So, so yeah. There, there it is. Up and running. Okay, thanks for watching. Uh, so hopefully... Uh, this is an exp kind of experiment video. We're just starting it, and in the next couple months, uh, we'll see how dusty my room is. I will cl I'll clean it up one of these days. All right, thanks for watching. That is the Levoit 100S air purifier. All right, I bought this guy for my anime figures and for my lungs. All right, thanks for watching. Here's me out. All right, hey, he's Mega here, and uh, this is the kind of follow-up video clip for uh, the Levoit Vital at 100S. And uh, there it is; it's still doing the thing. It's February 2024, guys. I shot that last, the last, the previous video, in like September of 2023. So it's been 
like half a year since the last the, that last clip okay so so I can do a pretty good follow-up um, anyway so I've had it. it it's been running like non-stop I just put it on auto all the time and it's usually at the lowest setting all right it doesn't really move that much air um, maybe I should put it a little higher I don't know but I I hardly know it's on <laughs> all the time all right the only time I, the only way I really know it's on is when I see the lights on the display on, it's on right now because my, my light is at the highest setting. When I when I when I dim the lights in my room, the all the lights turn off on it, all right? If it's if it's dark, okay? Um, if I put my hand over the exhaust, I can feel a little bit of air. So that's how that's how I know it's running, okay? So and it runs all the time, okay? Um, I haven't had to change the HEPA filter yet. Okay, we'll check the app out real quick. Um, and uh, and yeah, I have seen it speed up a little bit um and and so the big question is does it really reduce the amount of dust in the room you know um so i, ha I have to say a little bit all right it helps a little bit i've noticed um the room's a, lo a little less dustier but stuff still gets dusty you're still gonna have to dust stuff but it helps a whole lot and a nice thing is if you're dusting stuff in your room you know, you don't want to dust it and then like it's just going to get, it's just going to go somewhere else. What you can do is blow the dust towards the uh, the air purifier and it'll it'll suck the dust in and it'll keep it, it'll suck it into the filter, okay? Um, I've only had, oh man, I can't, I'm not sure. In this, in this like six months, I think I've only had to clean the pre-filter like twice, all right? And I don't even take it out of the thing. I vacuum it, all right? I get a vacuum when I clean it. We'll open it up and we'll check it out. It's I think it's pretty dirty. The last time I looked at it, it was pretty dirty, uh, but I didn't clean it, <laughs> okay? Uh, and then, yeah, we'll take a look at the app, see how much life we have left in it. And then uh, that'll be the end of the video. We'll, we'll, we can check the room out. I said I was gonna clean my room, and I think I did, but it's already been like six months, and it's it's pretty much as dusty as it was already. Also, it's winter time right now, and I get uh, I get dry skin in the winter time, and, and like it only only in the winter time, only in the winter time, guys. And so when I clean up my room, I, when I'm sweeping the floor and stuff, I see a lot of my skin flakes all over the room. Uh, it's it's freaking nasty. So um, yeah, unfortunately, a lot of it, all well, most of it falls on the floor and not on my figures and stuff. Okay, <laughs> but yeah, it's kind of gross. Um, it's just, I don't know, there's something wrong with me, like, <laughs> every winter I get like this, okay? O only during the winter time, guys. Not even, like, not even in, like, the beginning of winter. It's, like, kind of, like, in the middle of winter. My, my skin lets, gets like this, like, like clockwork, okay? I get, I get, like, dry skin, and I get rashes, and, and stuff like that. If you, if you guys have something like that, let me know, alright? And, and if you have some kind of remedy for it, it would be nice, man. But, actually, this year... Hasn't been too bad because um, the it's been raining a whole lot, so it's it's kind of it's a little more moist than usual. But I'm still getting it. I'm st I, every time I sweep the floor, I, I see my skin lying around. It's it's gross. <laughs> All right, it's like just these, these little white flakes, you know. Okay, let's go take a look at this bad boy. Uh, we'll kind of take a look around the room a little bit to see how well it kept the dust off of everything. But it like I said, it's been six months, so it the dust has come back. So. I'm gonna have to like dust everything again, but I'm trying my best to keep the dust off of everything. Alright. Okay, there it is. The Levoit air purifier. So one thing is the actual unit is dusty itself. <laughs> okay. I have to do some cleaning on this guy, okay? Um uh, but yeah, let's go open it up. Uh let's let's check the app real quick. Okay. Okay, here's the app. Okay, it says the outdoor PM 2.5 is 8, and the pollen is medium to high. Wow, okay, who'd have thought? It's actually, there's, uh, it's, there's like allergens outside. Maybe that's why I feel like doo-doo. <laughs> okay, anyway, it says the air quality, the indoor air quality is very good, so that's good. All right, outdoor, it's not so good, but indoors, it is. All right, and there's, uh, so it says the filter has 38% re life remaining, mm, maybe around when it gets to close to like, maybe 20 or 15% I'll go buy a new filter all right that's the indoor air quality as you can see it looks good all right here's here's what it's looked like the last couple days okay oh ooh, look at it so you got some spikes up there see so so it does um, and so the, this is how fast the fan is going and it never changes dude it's always the same okay I guess that's as far as it goes 
that's what the what it looks like every week same fan speed the whole time so pretty much all oh, it speed up it's sped up here Sunday and Monday it's sped up a little bit okay so pretty cool okay this, the app will actually tell you when you should probably clean the filter and I think it did and um, I didn't clean it so <laughs> all right let's go open up this bad boy and check a look at the pre-filter real quick and we'll take a look at my room a little bit all right so that's what it looks like it's pretty dirty <laughs> look at the bottom right here there's all sorts of stuff on there all right and I'll show you how I clean okay, it. okay so yeah the best way I the best way to clean it is to probably just remove it and then and then like clean it with the vacuum and then uh, clean it in the sink all right just um, run some water over in the, the opposite direction but the easiest way to clean it is to just get a vacuum cleaner and then clean the very front okay and that's exactly what we're gonna do right now okay so you'll see how dirty it is when when we uh, when we vacuum it <laughs> And so that just goes to show it works. Also here, this is what I do. Um, okay, this is this is a optional part for one of my figures. You can't, you, it's, it's Inosuke from <laughs> Demon Slayer. So what I'll do when I'm dusting something, all right, I'll take, uh, say, let's say I want to dust this. I have a little, one of these little um, blower dealies, okay? It's for, for dusting stuff. I got it at Daiso, it's like, it's like a dollar store thing, okay? <laughs> And then I, I shoot it towards the filter, okay? Now, I guess a good thing to do would be to increase the speed of the fan when you do it, okay? You saw all that stuff go there, so... And then you can shoot, dust it around there. Also, maybe dust this. I see my skin flakes there. Gross. <laughs> okay, you got it. It doesn't get all the dust off, but it just gets the, you know... Fortunately, there's a bag over this one, okay, so... But that, that's what I do when I'm dusting stuff. I, I, I shoot it towards the, um, the air purifier and the air purifier will suck the dust in, all right? That way you don't have it floating around and getting on other stuff, all right? So it, it's actually filtering stuff, all right? You turn, you've effectively turned it into a large uh, vacuum cleaner, <laughs> okay? All right, so we're gonna go clean it right now. I'll show you how I clean it. Turn the vacuum on. <laughs> Start, but just, you just vacuum it, that's it. And then you can start to see, you can see through it a lot better. idea to clean this thing too okay the front but there it is okay we'll put the cover back on okay I have not cleaned the dust sensor uh, I haven't got the warning about the dust sensor but I believe the dust sensor is right here let me put it back on auto yeah I rarely I rarely speed this thing up guys <laughs> okay let's go check this dust sensor out Open this, and then, oh, t you're supposed to take a cotton swab and put it in there or something. Okay, I just looked so. at the manual, and it said every two months that you should, uh, you should, um, clean the dust sensor, all right? Or when it reports there's, there's a lot of, uh, bad air or something all the time, uh, that means it's probably getting clogged up. All right, so what you gotta do is you gotta turn it off. So I will turn it off. Okay, it's off right now. And I got some water here, just in a spray bottle. I'm gonna go shoot this, okay? And it's, I think it says it wants you to clean this. And this. Oh, it's pretty dirty, it's kinda dirty actually. <laughs> yeah, it's a little bit of dirt coming out of it. Okay, and then I think, I want you to clean in here or something. It's not dirty at all. I just gotta clean around that area. Oh, 
really know what exactly what it wants to clean. It wants you to clean something here, here, and then like in here somewhere. So that's what I did, and I only took I only took one cotton swab. All right, I I took two out, but <laughs> so there you go. I just cleaned the dust sensor. I don't think I had to, but if it if it does tell you to clean it, then that's what that's how you clean it. All right, so. I, ha I haven't had to clean it the whole time I've owned it, so um, it is kind of dirt dusty though. I should probably clean it Okay, turned it on Okay The ring is red Okay, so I guess when you clean the air the the dust um, The dust sensor it kind of it gets kind of crazy But it went from it said bad earlier and now it says moderate so I'm just gonna let it run until it, it says the air quality is good But it was it was fine before oh there we go see that just turned green now What does green mean green means it's good. Okay, so and then I guess there's there's very good also so um, Yep All right guys and with that uh, that's the end of this uh, my show-and-tell video on the Lavoie Vital 100 s all right. I genuinely believe it does keep the room a little less dustier okay a little bit less dustier it's not gonna suck in all the dust okay it, it, it can only do so much all right so you're still gonna have to clean up you're still gonna have to dust and clean up stuff but it's it's not as bad all right and like I said I kind of use it as a big vacuum cleaner <laughs> I when I dust stuff I, I just go here and I, I sh blow the dust off into the thing all right and it sucks it in right and um, yeah it definitely and and I, I hope hopefully it's keeping the air clean in here. It always says the air is fine in here, so I guess that's good. But I we haven't had yeah, luckily we haven't had a lot of wildfires this last year or this year. So it's uh been pretty good. Every once in a while I'll see it spike up though. So okay, so anyway, thanks for watching. Uh, I'll put a link in uh uh I'll put an Amazon link where you can buy one of these guys and the filters and all that stuff. Um and uh and yeah, alright. I hope this was educational and entertaining. Peace out.